<laughs> it won't be for long. <coughs> yeah. It's up to you. You can join in or not. They're gonna they, Are they even? Okay, well if, okay. And what's this game called? This line ball is basically just off the dead. Alright, so line ball. Whenever I blow the whistle, y'all start, right? It's king of the mountain. Well, that didn't take long. Oh. Got to shoot from the line. Oh, he knocked you out. directions. We know which team is not going to win on three thro free throws.
Why do we never bounce when their muscles are cold? Because we can tear them. So what Felix is doing over there is a bad idea, right? You static stretch it first and then you can bounce, right? But if you, do, if you overdo it one time, you can tear the hamstring and, not, and then it'll, it'll be short for the rest of your life. Huh? Yeah. Well, not every coach knows this, right? And we never stretch cold muscles and I see PE teachers going out and doing stretches as their first activity. All the time. When I was in high school, that's the first thing we did. Can you stretch a cold rubber band? <laughs> no, warm up, then stretch. Increase the core, right? Increase the core temperature. Especially on cold days. Yeah. You should have learned this in 111, right? But, but we try to overlap. We overlap things. Hamstrings and uh, groin muscles and lower backs are what my college students tend to pull. If they're, they don't warm up like they're 14 years old, you know. So those of you that are real tight kind of guys, particularly you need to really get warmed up before you start playing basketball next class. Like come in here and... And, and make yourself sweat before we start playing. We're doing handstands. Team, right? Yes, handstand, or or me if we get that far. Um, we got a lot of progressions. You got to if you can't successfully do a um, kick up or a, a switcheroo. Yeah. Then we're not doing that because we don't want. Can I try? We'll see how you do in your progression. Can't keep those elbows locked. We can't let you do it, huh? Right leg, left hand. Oh. Hopefully, but remember, they only get, they get to come back in. But the second time, they're out until that teacher finishes teaching their lesson. We really need to push the discipline. And when you do gymnastics, I'd warn, warn the whole group yeah, first. Oh, that's what I'm doing. And let's get the twist right Well, you didn't see what happened to the previous teacher. He was so worried about All right. discipline, he forgot his motivation. That's it. Okay. Yes, I'll go over here with Taylor first. <coughs> Wait, I did Taylor last time. Let me do Trey first this time. We're not going. We're not using the middle court right now. If you want to just scoot over. Everything he's saying. Can you hear him? Yeah. All right, well, Danica and Britt, don't go down there. I thought that goal was down, but the angle. Yeah, it, it's messed up. Yeah, it's Felix and me are going right. That one's good. All right, y'all can go right. Don't yeah. just work on your drop step. We'll work it from the left side first, and then we'll switch it over. Get, get loud so the camera's not going to be able to hear you. 
talk loud. Danica, do you have an ankle brace? Pivot on the ball of your foot, on your heel. Looks like a pro. I saw her right I, I, I'm really glad I could take a shower. Glad it's at 7.30 in the morning and not at 3.30 in the afternoon. Smell the right guard. And you're immortalized on film. After our Layford presentation, we had six of those people go subscribe to my channel. Oh, yeah? So y'all should feel right, good. I'm so proud of y'all. Really. Yeah. We're going to start off at the same spot. But this time we're going to fake like we're going to the goal from the left. We're going to come inside. To about the middle of the paint. Triple hook shot. Yeah. Not always the most high percentage shot, but it's very useful. Let's see what it looks like. would help if you actually hit the rim. Oh, that, that wasn't even close to a fake. Nobody's going to believe that. Just 
because you were a guard doesn't mean you need, don't need to learn how the other people play. You got to coach everybody, huh? Make sure since we're coming this way, shooting with our left, going up our right. I think she needs to move that foot if she wants to make me believe it. Look over your both shoulders. Look, they won't believe you if you don't turn your head. They're not gonna believe you're gonna go that. Well, yeah, when you turn your head, that'll make a move, right? Fake left, go right. And you're not used to having to think about what you're doing, huh? One thousand repetitions, and it'll become fluid. For your kids. You've just got to get where you can demonstrate it without pressure for them and then they can. But you can tell who played what positions because of the drills. You can tell the inside and the outside people. That should make it a little easier. A secret. If you see that they're trying to skip through the first couple of parts, you know that the only thing they're thinking about is making that goal. 
Yeah. You make them do it without the ball. Then they start working about their steps, especially with younger kids. You feed them so it's not All right, guys, hold the ball. Next thing we're going to work on is the fadeaway. That's pressure. I'm not actually videoing the, 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 that, yes, just. It is. It, hey guys, don't worry about making it right now. We're working out the test. Well, I think you changed the steps on that one. What you have to do with kids is a lot of times take the ball away from them make them do the pretend stuff otherwise they don't want to think about their feet they only think about the end product one thousand repetitions to automate a skill we're not going to get a thousand repetitions today are we we're just learning how to teach it basically Another thing you can do, Trey, is if you see that they're all making the same mistakes, then pull them back in and redemonstrate it and, and go over the common errors they're making. If you had 30 people in a class, because you'd have no way of being able to go around and give feedback individually to all 30 people. have some bad habits in basketball. Hard to, break. Hard to break those bad habits. But we have to, when we're teaching kids, we want to teach them the right way. Right. I learned how to shoot basketball. I never learned those. But, but, All right, guys, let's try to go on the other side now. Expand your repertoire.
when we when we switch in about five minutes would you uh, care to be his partner when they go down there for just a, a few minutes okay I'll tell you when They're switching now. They're switching. Come on. That's Felix. Thank you. They just they need to drill better. We're missing a bunch of people today. So. Felix, you got a partner here. Do you feel like joining them, Yuki? Yeah, I figured you can need an another body. Okay. We're going to start off dribbling. We're going to learn our position here. So what we're going to do is we're going to go to each cone. And for the first one, we're just going to go through our legs. So you're going to get to this cone. Now, obviously I'm not skilled, but we're going to get to each one, go through the cone, and get that last one. Do the same dribble. And go and do a layup. And uh, we're gonna have this this line start first. Just give them a head start so y'all don't run into each other. Alright, so Claire, whenever you're ready, go ahead. You are get low, Claire. Yeah, guys, when y'all get to the end, y'all can just come straight back. Just come straight back. Well, she's pretty good. Yeah. So we knew who our guard is, huh? On that team, we definitely know. That's some ball skills. Alright, now what we're going to do is just uh, behind the back. So you're going to get to each one, behind the back. And whenever you finish, same thing, you lay up at the end. Alright, so you're going to do whatever you're going to do. Basically hug it to your hip and kind of cup it right here. And just kind of roll it off after you get out to the outside. Now you're going to get to the cone, stick inside. Got it? Alright, I'm going to give you touch. Go ahead. There you go, now stay low. Keep it with that uh, left hand, feel it? Tell them how to do it. Good job, Jess. Oh, yeah. Look at that. Alright, y'all, now we can break up into three. 
But uh, you have to watch this demonstration from uh, Felix if you don't mind. Stand up. Now what am I do? Clear. I'm gonna have to come right there. Pass it. And then guard. You uh, pass. You don't want to just stand there. So rush the lane. Get the pass. Come in on this side. Lay it in. And then y'all just keep uh, doing that drill. And then we're gonna switch it over to the other side, right? So y'all, this side, y'all can go in there. Then go over there. It's a three person drill. My camera was on you. Yeah, that's Does what, it. exactly what I said. Okay. All right. All right. Okay, pass. There you go. Okay. Claire, you pass. Drive the lane. Not open. Check for the ball. Oh, that was good. But, all right. You're already all the way out there, you know. So once you're, if, like, say this is the three point line, I'm standing out there with you. You don't want to just stop for a shot right here, you might as well take that step back. And then you can, that way at least you'll get three, it's basically the same shot. You get one. Almost.
So close. It's certainly not automatic yet, is it? Almost everything is opposite body. Would you yeah. like our guests to play too? Yeah, if they, if they yeah, want we to. put one on each team. Yeah, that's what we were gonna do before, and they'll play. Yeah. They're all right with that. All right, well, I'm gonna have to split y'all up. I don't want too many. Girls. Why can't we have two Because ask him if he wants to play, yes. then you can play. Hey. 
He might have forgot to eat that stuff. Maybe something down there. Okay, give me a purple. Go play game. You will get sweaty if you play. You can play if you want. But you probably will get all sweaty if you play. You fine with that? Yep. All right, you can play on this team. Purple team, we'll be on first. All right, you guys are here. This team right here, y'all are here. Can we get some red pennies? Yeah, if you have enough red or orange. If we have enough light blue. We can go like this. Oh, look, we have enough. Okay, so we... Yeah, it might be cold outside, but it's not cold in here. Yes, safety issue. you play a little longer. Teamwork.
Yes, it is time. Time!